Hello. Hello. Here we are in an airplane. Mm -hmm. Would you like a juice or water? Ching ching. Ching ching. <laughs> I've never been in China. Premium economy before. Me neither. They brought out orange juice and water. Chris got some dry socks. In real glass. <laughs> Here we are. In a pub. Fish and chips on the way. Main street instead of where we needed to be. Where you at? Uh, you know, London. London. Walking around London. So we just walked around Mayfair, Piccadilly. This is where the hotel is, the Intercontinental Hotel. We do not belong here. No. <laughs> Not at all. There was, uh, there's going to be a lot of interest in that DJ in my Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Somebody just <laughs> casually street parking their Lamborghini Aventador. <laughs> just, just street parking. Not, not a big deal. No big deal. Yeah. So this is our hotel, and we'll see if we have a room. We don't have a room yet, so we'll see. Oh, the train's trip away. Yeah, still set up for it. Alright. Sarah in London. Uh, I was personally invited to the Queen's trip away. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Walking around Chelsea. It's a beautiful street. Mm -hmm. Slowly making our way to dinner. So good. Oh my gosh, one of the best meals ever. Like so ever. good. Oh. So good. Escalator. Very tall, very steep escalator. Yeah, I think that's level. Found our way to Hyde Park. Pigeon. That would be a and pigeon. Now the bugs too. I do my very best to avoid other <laughs> I feel like the least other things can do is show the same respect. <laughs> and avoid you. Yeah. 
What's this? I mean, this park kind of puts Centennial to shame. Yeah, it does. Well, it's, it's like, like an there. actual park. I know. Whereas Centennial is just grass. Why didn't we get silver wax with our desserts? I don't know. We got dessert to go from dinner, but we have no silverware to eat it with. I feel like I can't eat that flan with my fingers. <laughs> you can't eat that flan? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> I can't eat that plan with me fingers. It's a little bit. <laughs> oh, oh, might have found something. Might have found, nope, not there. Ralph, have you have you seen my have you seen my nut sack, nut stash? Ralph, no. Okay. Are you sure? No. Dang it. Little paddle boats out there. Oh, oh, that's what I said. I know. It's the remnants of the Jubilee <laughs> being deconstructed. Sarah's on her way to breakfast. <laughs> It's cruise day. Cruise day? <laughs> We're at Victoria Station, Coach Station, ready to get on our bus. We're gonna head down, down to Dover. I think it's a two hour bus ride to get down to Dover and then we're gonna get on the cruise ship. Getting on the ship? Not the ship. What am I talking about? We're getting on the bus on the way to Dover to get on the ship. Last one's on the bus, I think. <laughs> on the bus. We're going to go <laughs> So this is the bus on our way to Dover. <laughs> There's a toilet down there. <laughs> Goodbye, Victoria Coach Station. And of course, as I say that, we stop. Seventeen <laughs> <laughs> yeah.
Here we go. There's the ship. All right, you ready? Let's go do the, the cruise thing. We're about to get on the ship. Here we go. Port of Dover. Just got in the room, standing on the balcony. The famous White Cliffs of Dover. Uh, we just got on the ship. It's cruise day. <laughs> it's cruise day. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna go explore. We're gonna see what the the Carnival Pride is like. We haven't been on this ship. We haven't been on this class of ship before. Um, so. We're gonna go check it out. We're so excited. And uh, you'll see that now. Uh, I don't know. This guy's is open, I might think. Lido pool deck. Got the red frog and the blue iguana. Cover is open today. Guys, burgers over there in the corner. Blue Iguana Cantina. Welcome to the Carnival Pride. Sarah's looking for a snack. Of course, the biggest crowd is at the desserts. <laughs> Salad bar. Well, if that's not the healthiest first food on a cruise ship we've ever had. <laughs> and a Lynchburg lemonade and a Sancria swirl. Here in the Serenity deck. On the way in to Dover is a two hour drive. Had a sandwich. So we're gonna have a little salad. Kick the afternoon off with a little salad. Was it like three o'clock? Two thirty, three o'clock, yeah, something, something like that? that. Is, Dinner will be soon. Oh, 320. 320. We're here up on the Serenity deck. 21 and older on Serenity. Look at all those clamshells. Is it hot? Touch it. No. Is it icy cold? Yeah. yeah. So the water from <laughs> the power drencher is blowing onto the deck, two decks down. Probably not going that way. We'll walk around this way. The water slide, the twister. Wow, it is windy. So we were just outside, it is so windy. Oh yeah, it's a small ship. It is so windy. Um, hat almost blew away so we're inside now we're gonna go down to deck two deck two is where all of the fun stuff is all the fun shops and the alchemy bar and everything else so we're gonna go check that out right now and uh, we'll probably be spending some time there this evening after dinner before dinner happy to be here <laughs> all night long. don't give me a copyright strike YouTube that wasn't that close we were way off <laughs> I wasn't sure I was going to sing in at first, and then I was like, eh, just lean into it. Committed. <laughs> we just ran into, haven't said hi yet, ran into some people that were on the last cruise we were on, the Carnival Magic Heck 2019. Yeah. We recognize them. They're here. We'll have to say hi. Uh, walking around the ship, we just walked through the casino. Here's Still on deck two. We are about to pass Banzai Sushi. Trying to show it to you, but the camera won't turn around. There it is. Big venue on the Pride, Banzai Sushi. Sushi. That's not bad. We'll probably come here at some point for lunch or probably lunch. 
Oh, nice. And then this is the, I guess, the main lobby. We'll go get a look at David's Steakhouse. Up in that red funnel up there. Sweet. Found the alchemy bar. I mean, to say that we're excited about that is an understatement. <laughs> and then I thought this door was a nightclub. And it is, but not right now. And then I think this is the dining room. The MDR, as they say. Opposite side of the ship from comedy, yeah. but great location for dinner. Mm -hmm. So this is a it's a nice ship. Tiny. Okay, we're up one on deck three. Does that make your cruise so much better? Oh my god. Yes. We just got a message that the US might be ending the testing requirement to get back in before we need to get back in. I don't know make, how to look it up though. Which will make this so much nicer of an experience. I can't. We'll just have to find out when we get back. Oh my gosh. So much less stress. <laughs> Jacket's here. Oh, nice. <laughs> In case you get cold. Baltic. I did not have these on our other cruise. They're seventy-two dollars. They must know that uh, people need warm weather, warm clothes, jewelry. Watches. Bags. All at a discount. Carnival store for all your branded gear. Fragrances. Cherry on top. Get your candy fix. Excellent. So that's the fun shops. Oh, is this piano bar? Yeah. Nice, okay. Looks like a nice spot. Yeah, it does. Big. It is big. This would be great. Yeah, and the bar is like next to the piano. <clears throat> so you can sit at the piano and yeah, yeah. sit out here. Awesome. This is a grand staircase. <laughs> and Sarah found the warehouse. Where's the ski ball at? Oh. Is there ski ball? There might not be ski ball. Oh my god. There's no ski ball. <laughs> That's a personal attack. They took the ski ball away. I guess that's just not happening. All right, well this is our first and last time in the arcade. That's a real shame. We had a lot of fun playing ski ball on our last cruise. Always looking for a good ski ball table. And it's not here. And uh, on behalf of your captain, Captain Reno, all his officer staff and crew would like to welcome you all on board the beautiful Carnival Pride for yet another amazing vacation in our European season. So I'd like to invite you all to join us on Lido Deck as uh, we say uh, goodbye to Dover for now as uh, we fully and we have our sail away party and we celebrate our cruise to Norway. So I'd like to see everyone up on Lido Deck. Whatever you do, have a wonderful time. Welcome aboard. I'm looking forward to meet you all. So we're here on the Carnival Pride and I guess we could tell you a little bit about how we got here. So we flew into London Thursday morning. We left Wednesday night from Nashville. It's a direct flight, it's great. We spent half a day in London Thursday, and then we had a little bit of time this morning on Friday to spend in London. We got 
had some breakfast. We walked around a little bit. And then we got on a bus, the Carnival Transfer, and the bus took us all the way down to Dover. So we got here about 2, two o'clock, 2.30, and uh, got on the ship, and we've been walking around on the ship since then. It's almost it's 5.15 right now. I think we are supposed to sail away at 4.30, but we're about to do that now. And then we'll be on our way. Uh, tomorrow's a sea day. So we'll be on our way, leaving Dover shortly. There's a view from our balcony. You can see the white cliffs of Dover. So I think we're gonna go down to Alchemy, get a drink. It's 5.30. Probably hang out down there till dinner till time. Till dinner time. So, see you down there. Sailing away. Here we are. Back again. Back again at the Alchemy with the 40 is the new 20. Still at the Alchemy bar. <laughs> like two hours later. I got a Manhattan. And Sarah finished her second drink. Basil drop. What are you gonna get next? <laughs> Nobody needs to know about your eyebrows. <laughs> Cucumber sunrise. Nice. Okay. An hour wait for the your time dining. We made it to dinner. It is eight o'clock. It's eight o'clock. We did the uh, the check-in on the app to get a table, and when we were on the Magic, it was five minute, ten minute wait for a table. It was an hour wait to get a table for the Your Time Dining on this ship today. We'll, uh, we'll see how it goes. Should be good. We're in the MDR. Very excited for dinner. I have not seen the menu yet. Sarah has. I think she probably has her meals picked out. Good. What'd you get, Sarah? I got the corn and poutine. How is it? Delicious. We also got a salmon dish to share. And I got some fried calamari, which I'm sure will be quite good. This is the appetizer round. Main courses to come. The calamari was very good, as I thought it would be. The smoked salmon was fantastic. Really very <laughs> delicious. It was really, really good. <laughs> what? <laughs> Sarah, how's your soup? It's delicious. I feel like I got this when we were on the Magic, but I'm not sure that I did because it's quite spicy this time. Okay. But it still is very good. Excellent. Yeah. So, first course. Very happy with the first course. Main's coming soon. I completely forgot to film during dinner. <laughs> uh, I had a steak, which was tasty. Sarah had the brisket. beef brisket. Mm. Good reviews on both fronts. Except mine was better. Uh, disagree. That's but what I hear. <laughs> From those that matter, yeah. that's what I hear. <laughs> Dinner was good, night one. Uh, we're gonna go to the room, take a break for a minute, and then we're gonna go back out. Uh, I think we have comedy at 10.45. Mm -hmm. So late show for comedy tonight. And uh, we'll see what happens. We may end up at the nightclub. We'll see. The other two. Yeah, with the two other two, the other two young people. There's an older crowd on the Norwegian cruise. How about this? It is nine o'clock, and the sun is still above the horizon. It's definitely going to be a different kind of cruise on this one because I don't think we're gonna ever see darkness. I think the sun will set. It will go below the horizon eventually, but uh, for now, 
It's just hanging out there. What's that thing over there? Uh, tanker ship? It's like it's flat. Wow. I don't know if you can see that on the video. There's definitely a ship just below and to the left of the sun. But look, there's another one over there. That's the one I was thinking. Oh, wow, I didn't yeah. even see that one. <laughs> We got some drinks from Alchemy, but we ended up back at the Red Frog Pub. It's a little bit funny. Okay, there's a scene here. Alchemy's a little dead right now, but the Red Frog, Red Frog has some good music. Going to comedy. Punchliner. Oh, Ready for comedy? Comedy shows. Enjoy the show. Punchliner. Hopefully it's good. I don't think this cruise is very full because there are a ton of seats for punchliner still. Like a lot. Are you trying to get pizza? I didn't think it would happen. But here day, we are. day one, late night pizza. Look, they do have cookies up there. Oh, well, that's exciting. <laughs> it's a crowd at the Pizza Pirate. Mm -hmm. Here we go, late night pizza at the Pizza Pirate. Y'all, it is 11.40. Sarah was having some Quattro Formaggio. A little late night pizza. We just got back from the comedy club, which was great. Very funny. I don't remember the guy's name, Tony unfortunately. Vino. Tony Vino. Can I have some pizza? We may check out the nightclub. I don't know if we'll stay. It is night one. Part of it's a gag. We have a sea day tomorrow, so we got a lot of time to recuperate in the morning. Probably and gonna do sea day brunch in the morning. Sea day brunch in the morning. It's only, uh, what, 5.30 at night at home? The night is young. I think we're caught up on the jet lag, so it's 11.30, mm -hmm. but I think we're gonna go to the nightclub. We're having some pizza right now, and uh, we'll be back. Pizza was terrible. Just absolutely awful. Nope, I love the Pizza Pirate. So good. Chris and I have a bet on how many people are in the nightclub. It's a different demographic than our, our usual. So, Chris bets 12, I bet 5. We'll see who wins. <laughs> What's going to happen is it's we'll no one. See. It is an older ship. I mean, how old are we though? Like, I'm already looking up brunch menus. <laughs> Like, oh, what can we have for brunch? <laughs> yeah. Not a lot of action in the Vibe nightclub tonight. Sarah got down with some wobble, though. I think we're going to call it a night. I'm going to see. It's like 12.30. <laughs> the, the ship seems like it's asleep. We were yeah. one of... One of maybe 12 people, 10 people in the <laughs> nightclub. So, uh, we're on our way back to our uh, room. A lot of the, uh, a lot of the venues are closed down. Obviously, it's the end of the night. First night, we got a sea day tomorrow, but I think we're gonna go to bed. So, walking back to the room right now. Night one, day one, in the books. And, and, we are clearly not that far north yet because it's dark out. Although, wow. although 
there is some light on the horizon. Just a little bit, but there's some light on the horizon. And there's the moon reflecting yeah, onto the water. There, yep. I don't know wow. if you can see that. There's another ship way out there. So, we have a sea day tomorrow. We're going to be out, you know, all day on the ship. Find something fun to do. Tell you all about it. I think that's it. I think that's it for night one on the Carnival Pride on our Norwegian Fjords cruise. Woo!